Okay, now our um, CAD model and finite element meshes are ready. Now we can create a new simulation model using um, this CAD model and the finite element meshes that we have prepared um, on the platform. So to do so, we simply click on this plus button and we say new content. Now we need to uh, create a physical simulation. So here I'm simply going to search for simulation. And out of that, I'm going to use physics simulation. Okay. Now it's asking me what kind of simulation I want to create. So there are different types of simulations that are available. Um, we simply need to create a structural scenario simulation. So we select that. And in structural scenario simulation, we can do a structural simulation thermal or a coupled thermal structural simulation. Here we are going to do a structural simulation. Okay. So here the assistant opens up on the, on the side. It's telling us what things need to be done for us to be able to complete this simulation. So we can close that if you don't want this for now. We'll open that later if we need it. And we can right click on this physics simulation to, um, uh, to re, uh, to change its name. So we change the name to demo dash UAV score A sim. So it is a simulation. Okay. So now our name is changed here. Um, and, um, you would notice that we have our model uh, under the simulation scenario results. This is MSR. So under scenario, we will start putting our simulation scenario. And once the simulation scenario is run, our results will appear here. So what you see is that um, the modeling apps enable the effective coordination of modeling and analyst teams because the modeling teams can create the model the geometry, the meshes, and analysis teams can run the simulations. So it is essential that analysts and designers have access to a single source of truth, which is able to maintain a dynamically changing set of requirements. Furthermore, as a simulation model evolves, its pedigree is maintained. Not only do you have access to what the design currently is, but you can gain an understanding as to how the design came to be.